Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. It's Shani. If you're new, welcome. Um, I am a mom of a two year old, um, two and a half, and today I am doing my spring slash summer haul. I did catch a really great sale at um, Old Navy, so I do have a couple of fall pieces because they have a little fall vibe to them, um, and she's growing like a weed, so uh, even though we are two, we're moving into the 3T, so a lot of clothes that I have will be a mixture of two and 3T. I went to a couple places over this month, in the past month. Um, I hit up Burlington, one of my favorite places, also Target. Um, Old Navy, like I said, we went to Walmart. We got a lot of great pieces, affordable, um, super, super inexpensive. So we'll have a collaboration of shoes, shorts, tops, PJs, everything. So if you're interested in what we have, keep on watching. To start off with, um, I did go to, like I said, one of my favorite places, which is Burlington. So over the time, this has been accumulated. I did get a lot in one time because I did some retail therapy. So it's it's good, but it's 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 a lot. Um, so one of the first pieces I have is this cute little denim top, which I got from Burlington. Um, it's branded limited too. I believe I paid maybe like ten dollars for it. So it's really cute. Lace top with a bow and the denim with the shorts with the tie belt. My daughter is super, super slim, but tall. So when I get a lot of things that are 2T or 3T, they'll fit her in the right places, but the pants just fall right off of her. So I actually need to invest in like a little belt. This does go off the shoulder. It's super cute. She did wear this once. We were gonna do it for Easter pictures, but we didn't pan out with the Easter bunny too well. Um, secondly, well, no first or second, cause I'm just gonna keep going. I do have this pajama set. It is Trolls. We are so much into Trolls right now. All this little section right here came from Burlington. This was a two-piece set um, with another set of PJs, but we definitely wore some of these clothes already, but this is the one that we haven't touched yet. Super, super cute. I have this in 3T. Uh, I need her pajamas to last uh, for some reason. She can only wear pajamas for like three, three to six months before they just don't fit anymore. So I did get a 3T in her pants and all her PJs. Also got this cute little Moana set. This was $7.99 at Burlington Jaw. Like how cute is this? It's a Disney outfit. It was just a one set, but it's super cute. And this is what I mean. Like the shorts will fit her lengthwise, but they'll be so wide that I'll probably have to cinch them, but this is PJs, so I'm not super worried about it. We also love Moana. So anything, as you know, if you have kids, singing, dancing, we love Moana, we love trolls, we love everything that sings. And this is super cute, and she thinks she's Moana too. Uh, next up, I got this super cute Minnie Mouse set. We are Minnie in real life with the two puffs. If you see on my Instagram, if you follow me, you know my daughter is infamous for her big puffs and her two puffs. Um, so we got this cute one. I did get another Ariel set. The Little Mermaid, but we did wear one of those. And they are three-piece sets, so they come with two shirts and a pair of shorts. So with the Ariel set, we did wear the tank top yesterday with the shorts, so all was left is the shirt, so I took that out. And then also we have her Easter dress. So hopefully I get this video up before Easter. Um, and this is her Easter dress, super cute. Grandma wanted to go with a yellow theme, so it has the yellow little lace fringe at the bottom. Super cute, I love florals. I love anything with a little cap sleeve or mini, um, what's the word I'm looking for? Mini sweaters. I would think they look adorable on kids. Um, it has a bow in the back as well as the front, but they don't tie. They're automatically tied, so that's awesome, so she can't pull it apart. And I only paid $16.99 for this dress. It is adorable. And I did get this in 2T because she can wear dresses that are actually her age range size. Also from Burlington, to go with that dress, I picked up these cute, adorable sandals. Um, these are an A. As she grows, her feet grow too. Um, and so I got all of her sandals in an A. I'm scared that before summer's over, she'll be in a 9. Um, but she's about... A seven and a half to an eight. Sevens run a little too small. She does have some room in these because they're open toe. Um, so she does have room to grow in these. And these are super cute. White with the pearls with the gold trim. 
And like I said, I got those in an eight. So we did stop by Walmart and got her a couple bottoms to go with all the tops that we're gonna start getting. Um, like I said, she could still fit most of her two T tops or 24 mm tops, but all her pants have to be in th uh, three T now because she's just so tall. Um, so I did get a basic black pair and these were super, super inexpensive, 348. I love Granimals and they don't shrink in the wash. So I did get a basic black pair. She does wear black pants to her daycare, her school. Um, so you can never have enough black pants. Um, this really cute mint color. I don't know if the light's washing it out, but it's, it's a real pretty mint color. And like I said, $3.48, super inexpensive. And then we got some jeggings. Because what little girl doesn't need jeggings? We also got a gray pair in the leggings. She wore those already as well. And then these super skinny elastic waist pants in 3T. And I believe these were maybe uh, $9.97. Super cute. And that's the thing I said like about the waist. That's what bothers me when pants don't have um, actual buttons or zippers. The waist just is a little too wide for her. She's super, super slim, but she's super tall. And so they have the wash on the front. These are adorable. And that's the little bit from Walmart, aside for some toys. So we did go to Carter's. I didn't go crazy in Carter's. I just got what she basically needed. And what she basically needed was some denim shorts. I love denim shorts on little girls. Um, so I got these. Super cute. With the heart and sequins. Super cute. These are going to last all summer. I did get these in 2T. Um, I like her denim shorts to be kind of fitted. I don't like them falling off. Um, um, tights can stick, but jeans will just fall clean off. So I did get these in an actual 2T size. I got these little denim shorts. She did wear these, so there might be a little ice cream on them. But I had to show y'all how cute they were. These are in 2T, in the, uh, 24 months actually, and they fit her perfectly. So 24 months in 2T and her shorts are perfect size um, and a good length. She's actually slimming out in the thighs. So, And then also from Carter's, I got these gorgeous sandals. Her dad picked these out. These are so pretty. Um, they are gold with the gold glitter and then the silver braided. They do zip up in the back. All her sandals zip up in the back because um, Velcro, she'll just rip them right off. Uh, we have been wearing these, and these are actually $36 at Carter's uh, with a huge sale. So I believe I only paid about $14 for these sandals, which is a steal because they are adorable. And they're super sturdy. Like, I love how they're made. And Carter's sandals usually do last us all summer long. And then we're going to move into... oh. I did stop by the children's place um, to get her and her cousin some matching shirts. I put those in their Easter baskets. They're super cute. They say um, Daughters of Queens. They're adorable. They're light pink, like a muted pink, and they have like this shimmer, shimmer gold, so they look gorgeous. But I did get her this onesie, and it says Dad Daughter Squad. Um, she's going to be wearing this for Father's Day. I can get her dad the matching shirt off childrensplace.com. Um, and I did get this in a 18 to 24 months because one thing, my daughter can fit her onesies a size down. Don't ask me how, but ever since she was born, we stayed in newborn onesies up to three to four months. She can just always backlog her onesies. So onesies are still 18 months. I find the ones that are her age range, they just run baggy on her. We're just fitting into the 24 month ones. Um, we did get some sneakers from Payless. She's been wearing these, but they're super cute. These are, I believe, in an eight as well. I thought they were huge at first when I saw them, but she fits them so well. Um, some basic white flows. They go with just about everything. Like I said, she's been wearing these. I can clean them up a little bit. Um, they're so easy clean. They look like brand new. But of course, you know, a little wear and tear. We wear these to the park, but these are adorable. She needed some some little tennis shoes so she can run around all summer long in. Um, and then the last two places I went were TJ Maxx. I don't remember when I got from TJ Maxx other than, of course, I picked up a new diaper bag. 
as always, I will find a diaper bag on sale. Then I've added another one to my collection. I was using it, but I'm currently not using it now because we went to the park, so I put everything in a backpack. But this is the uh, a discontinued item, I believe, or it's on sale on their website. But this is the uh, Skip Hop Signature Duo in um, zigzag, or I can't remember the print that it's called, but it is super gorgeous. Um, it's a tote, and it does have the, um, the messenger strap, and of course, as all Skip Hop bags do come with. The stroller straps. Love, love, love. It is a huge bag. It is a huge bag. Um, it has a lot of storage in it. Oh. Forgot our Happy Meal toy in it. Um, and it does have this really nice mommy pocket right here. Um, of course, this will be a separate video. But when I find a bag... It's a $70 to $100 bag, and I see it on sale for $20. I will pick it up. Yes, I will pick it up. That is the part of my diaper bag habit because I find these beautiful Skip Hop and name brand bags for cheap. I haven't paid more than $40 for any of my bags other than my first Skip Hop, which is the Grand Central take it all bag tote and I paid a hundred dollars for that bag at Babies R Us before they closed down. My daughter was about three or four months old and I needed a bigger bag from what I had and I cashed out a hundred dollars on that bag to only find it a couple months later at Burlington for fifty dollars. Broke my heart. I could have just waited a little bit longer. And then last thing I have is what I got from Old Navy. Now like I said this isn't any spring or summer from Old Navy. This is more of a fall haul, but I could not pass this up. When I tell you these prices, you're probably going to die or run to Old Navy because these prices are ridiculous. I bought all this and I want to tell you I probably spent $10 on all this. Ridiculous. Um, so before I break anything, let's start off. So I got this onesie PJ set, the footed PJs. Um, like I said, I got mostly everything in 3T because she's growing out of it. This was on clearance for $2.47. So it's this very light pink with little bows on it. And it is super long. I can't imagine that my baby is this long, but she is. She's super long. And I know she's going to fit this so well. But I didn't want to put her in any of this before I got the video out. Now, this is more of a, a summer PJ because it is light. It's super light. Um, it's not like thick wool or anything like that it is super light it's not the fleece pjs it's the cotton ones but it's super super thin cotton um and so for two dollars and 47 cents how could i ever pass this up then i got this shirt it is on a 3t hanger but it is a 2t shirt she may be able to wear this her birthday is in november and it doesn't really get too chilly and it's super cute. It says VIPs, very important penguins. And this shirt was $1.99. This gorgeous shirt was $1.99. So um, the weather's up and down here in South Louisiana. It's storming outside right now. That's why I had the lights on. Um, one day it'll be chilly. It's getting to that spring part where it's chilly in the mornings, super hot in the afternoons, chilly again at night. Um, and then I got this super cute little dress. I try to buy her as many dresses as possible because she doesn't have a lot of dresses. Um, navy with the silver shimmer stars. This dress was $2.97. How adorable will this be with some leggings and some boots when the fall comes? I love dressing her for fall. Adorable. Next, I got them in two different colors, same style dress. Got this little faux tie in the front, kind of makes it look like a double dress. But it's just a one piece, super cute with a drop waist. Um, on two buttons, and it's navy blue with the polka dots. I'm starting to try to get her in different colors other than pink. And I think navy blue would look really, really good on her. It is kind of wide. So it does worry me. So I might have to wait till she's a little past three. But who knows when she gets through, turns three, she might be in 4T. So this might fit her really well. But this looks a little wide for her. 
and then I can just imagine this one next year because I will store clothes up to a year um, next year for Valentine's Day how cute is this it's a red dress with little white um, hearts on it and like I said same style as that blue one but I think it looks way better in red and I'm sorry I paid $2.97 for both of these dresses um, $2.97 a piece and so that is super cute but like I said it is kind of wide and my daughter is super slim so like I said hopefully these will wait out getting down to the bottom I did get these three T um I guess you can say cargos kind of it's got pockets so it kind of gives me a cargo vibe but these are they call the um ballerina leggings these pants were a dollar 97 how could I not a dollar 97 And hopefully she'll fit these when the fall comes and she doesn't grow out of them too much I love this color I could par pair this with just about anything I was thinking about pairing it with that penguin shirt but it got warm on us already so we're in shorts and tank tops as of yesterday and then the very last thing I did get is some more leggings here on this hanger and these are 3t as well and they are red with flowers and the waist doesn't look too wide oh I'm sorry those those pants were $1.97 like I said and these leggings were $1.99 and they say full length hopefully full length means that they'll go past her ankles because <laughs> if they don't go past her ankles they'll end up at her calves and that's why I need all her pants in 3T. Hopefully I don't move into 4T no time soon. But these are super cute and the quality, they're super nice too. Um, I love Old Navy's clothes for toddlers. Um, they last. Um, so does Carter's. Um, I can get a good amount of time out of Carter's. It's just the amount of clothes that she has and the time that it takes to wash all the clothes. By the time she wears it again, she's grown out of it. So just like she was when she was a newborn, I'll probably get one or two good wears out of all her clothes. So if I ever wanna do a photo out that's something I need to do ASAP like get her in a picture get her in the clothes make it good because once they get washed get lost behind and I never see them again and by the time I do see them again they don't look the same on it they don't fit the same way um, but that is it for my haul I hope you guys enjoyed it um, it was definitely fun shopping again um, I took a little break from shopping from clothes from her because I had so many clothes but when it came down to her pants, I was like, well, we don't have no pants that fit. So now I have pants that fit. I have super cute dresses for her to get into. And like I said, she did wear a couple of the little outfits that I did have. So once I ever get those washed, uh, I can get, definitely get her in some pictures again. Um, so I do have a couple of ideas of my next upcoming videos. But as always, if you guys have any suggestions, always hit me up on my Instagram. Follow me on Twitter and my snapchat all at it's me shani except for twitter at at ask shani um and also i think some people do also follow me on facebook um and that's just my full government name if you do follow me on there so most people don't <laughs> um but other than that as always love you don't hesitate to comment subscribe and rate and um, i'll be back with another one Mwah. have a good one